Envision a future where the very air we breathe powers our world, transcending traditional energy sources like solar and wind. This vision has been brought closer to reality by University of Massachusetts Amherst visionaries, who've discovered how to convert humidity into electricity, termed hydroelectric power. Cascadachava is at the forefront, poised to commercialize this revolutionary technology, lighting our cities and powering our devices with the air's moisture. Welcome back to Mind Polish. In our quest for clean, renewable energy to combat climate change and achieve energy independence, the University of Massachusetts Amherst team, led by Professor Jun Yao, has made a groundbreaking discovery. While aiming to create an advanced air humidity sensor, a fortuitous accident revealed that their device could generate electricity from the air's humidity. This unexpected finding opens a new and exciting avenue for generating power, capturing our imagination beyond the familiar sight of solar panels on rooftops. This unexpected discovery by Professor Yao and his team, echoing the serendipitous breakthroughs that dot the history of science, hints at the potential to convert atmospheric moisture into electricity. Despite the complexities and mysteries surrounding the process, the team is pioneering research to decode how humidity can be used as an energy source. They are delving into the unknown, piecing together the intricate science that could make tapping into the humidity for electricity a reality. As we explore the groundbreaking innovation at UMass Amherst, it's important to recognize that our explanations simplify the complex science behind converting humidity into electricity. This captivating mystery invites us to delve further into how air moisture might transform our energy landscape, moving from science fiction to our everyday reality. The journey to harness humidity for power is just starting, promising a revolution in how we power our world. At UMass Amherst, researchers have made a breakthrough that redefines our understanding of capturing energy, focusing on nanotechnology's marvels. They've developed nanostructures only 100 nanometers thick, significantly finer than a human hair. These structures act as selective barriers for water molecules in the air, creating a complex maze that restricts their movement. Within these constraints, the water molecules' movements initiate a process believed to be deprotonation, transforming their kinetic energy into electrical energy. This intricate interaction opens up new avenues for generating power from the humidity in our atmosphere. The process initiated by the nanostructures at UMass Amherst isn't uniform but results in an electric imbalance similar to a battery's poles, all without moving parts, akin to a solid-state battery. Driven by curiosity, Professor Yao's team explored beyond initial discoveries, experimenting with materials like graphene oxide, polymers, and wooden nanofibers, even utilizing bacteria to create protein nanowires. Their experiments reveal that the technology's potential doesn't depend on the materials but on the nanostructure's exact size, highlighting the versatility and transformative capability of their approach to generating electricity from humidity. Despite the groundbreaking nature of the UMass AirGen device, it currently produces only a microwatt of electricity, sufficient to light up a single LED pixel, but not enough for the broader energy demands of our world. Yet, its small output masks its vast potential. Like a chorus created from individual voices, connecting multiple devices could generate enough power from air moisture to meet much larger energy needs, suggesting a scalable solution to our energy challenges. The concept of utilizing humidity for energy extends beyond academic research. Cascada Chava, a Portuguese firm, envisions bringing this technology from the lab to the marketplace, with plans for a pilot project in 2024. However, as this innovative frontier approaches, significant challenges and uncertainties remain about transforming this pioneering discovery into a broadly applicable, practical solution. Exploring the potential of hydroelectric power reveals its advantages over traditional renewable sources, showcasing the limitless scope of human creativity. This journey to convert humidity into electricity exemplifies not just innovation but a tribute to our relentless pursuit of sustainability. The air we breathe, commonly unnoticed, might offer the solution to a future energized by the planet's vital resources. As we navigate this path filled with unknowns and opportunities, 
we're invited to discover the unexplored prospects of our environment. In the world of renewable energy, the impressive sight of wind turbines and the powerful spectacle of hydroelectric dams represent the pinnacle of green energy. However, these symbols of sustainability are often out of reach for the average person, existing more as distant wonders than practical solutions. Imagine if sustainable power could be harnessed not from sprawling fields or grand rivers but directly within our homes, making it accessible to everyone, no matter their location, living space, or type of dwelling. Cascada Chava is on the verge of making home-based renewable energy a reality. Picture a device as compact as a washing machine, fitting seamlessly among your home appliances. This isn't for washing clothes, but a humidity battery, symbolizing the future of accessible renewable energy. It offers a solution for those facing challenges like limited sunlight, small living spaces, or restrictive rental agreements, providing a practical and groundbreaking alternative. The innovation of a humidity battery is its autonomy from the constraints that affect conventional renewable energy sources. Solar panels become ineffective under overcast conditions, and wind turbines cease to operate in the absence of wind. However, the humidity pervasive in our homes provides a steady energy source, independent of weather patterns or the time of day. This unvarying availability of moisture in the air has the potential to offset the sporadic nature of solar and wind power, offering a possibility for an uninterrupted energy supply. Cascada Chava's pioneering efforts in humidity energy face skepticism, given the field's novelty. However, their journey is part of a global exploration, with teams from Tsinghua University to the Beijing Institute of Technology delving into hydroelectric films and wearables. This worldwide research effort is extending technological boundaries, producing energy to power devices and marking the emergence of a promising, discovery-filled domain. Cascada Chava's journey, led by co-founder and CEO Andrei Lyabchik, showcases a commitment to innovation. Starting with a small device capable of lighting an LED, their ambition now targets uniting 20,000 units to create a significant energy source by 2024. This bold aim highlights a story of perseverance and vision, driving towards sustainable solutions that push beyond conventional limits. Standing at the threshold of a new era in renewable energy, the air holds vast, unexplored potential, urging a reassessment of power generation methods. Cascada Chava's journey, alongside a global network of researchers focused on humidity, paints a vision of a future where renewable energy is both universally accessible and essential to our everyday lives. While cost is a pivotal concern and moving from research to widespread use, the unfolding story promises a sustainable future, encouraging us to envision a world energized by the air around us. Cascada Chava's foray into humidity batteries embodies not only innovation but bold ambition, highlighting the significant effort required for commercialization. The company envisions a future where a device, akin in size to a washing machine, could meet a household's energy demands by generating an impressive 10 kilowatt hours of electricity daily. This vision suggests a transformative shift in our energy consumption and provision, capable of powering a 150 square meter home, excluding the energy for an electric vehicle. This development hints at a future where energy is not only sustainable but also plentifully available, marking a potential paradigm shift in energy accessibility. Navigating towards a future powered by humidity batteries faces significant hurdles, notably the cost. The projected levelized cost of energy, LCOE, for these batteries, crucial for assessing their economic viability over time, suggests a high initial investment, with prices expected between 14,000 and 18,000. This cost poses questions about widespread accessibility. However, when juxtaposed with the expenses of a 10kW solar panel system in the US, including rebates and tax incentives, the disparity narrows. Such a comparison fosters hope that future advancements, standardization, and mass production could lower the costs of humidity batteries potentially making this innovative technology accessible to a larger audience.
Airgen devices offer more than just financial benefits, their capacity to produce electricity from air humidity positions them as a potentially universal clean energy solution. This technology promises to democratize sustainable power access, especially for those unable to utilize solar energy. Its applications could be transformative, providing energy independence in humid regions, and acting as a critical support in remote areas, during power outages, or after disasters, highlighting its versatility and broad potential impact. Despite technical challenges, the scalability of nano devices highlights the potential of humidity batteries. Their initial use may be modest, but the capability to charge personal devices like phones and laptops anywhere marks a significant advancement. The precise power generation tailored to modern electronics voltage needs suggests a future where traditional battery limitations are overcome with innovative solutions. Reflecting on the potential of humidity-powered energy, we stand at the brink of a new era. Kaskadachava's evolution from a bold idea to a feasible reality embodies human creativity and the unwavering quest for solutions that may redefine our bond with Earth. Though uncertainties lie ahead, the prospect of harnessing the air for energy presents a vision of sustainability, accessibility, and resilience that inspires and challenges us to rethink our energy future. As we delve deeper into the world of humidity batteries, the allure of their potential becomes increasingly tempered by the reality of the challenges they face. The journey from a groundbreaking concept to a viable technology is fraught with hurdles, both known and unknown. Yet, in these challenges lies the essence of innovation and the relentless pursuit of progress. The vision of devices powered by air's moisture presents an exciting future, eliminating the need for frequent recharging. Imagine wearables like AirPods, harnessing energy directly from humidity, marking a shift towards a new battery era. This would mean devices that last longer and are liberated from the hazardous chemistries of today's energy storage, promising durability and safety. Despite the potential of humidity batteries, their journey towards full realization is filled with uncertainties. The core processes allowing these devices to convert ambient moisture into electricity are still not fully comprehended. Concerns regarding the efficiency of electron transfer and the technology's scalability raise doubts about its capability for substantial energy production, highlighting the challenges ahead for potential commercialization. Bringing humidity battery technology to market involves complex challenges. The materials and processes needed for the crucial nanostructures are expensive and difficult to obtain. Although Yao's research team has shared their discoveries openly, Kaskadachava's proprietary technology hasn't undergone peer review, creating a gap in widespread scientific validation of their method. The operational environment of humidity batteries poses unique challenges, including dust and pollen intrusion and potential corrosive effects of the materials used. These issues highlight significant concerns regarding the battery's durability and maintenance, emphasizing the gap between their theoretical promise and the practical realities of everyday use. The quest for humidity batteries as green energy remains enticing, symbolizing a broad vision for renewable energy that is diverse, accessible, and tailored to global needs. Although no single solution exists for our energy challenges, integrating AirGen technology into our renewable energy toolkit signifies progress towards a sustainable and resilient future. At the edge of this new frontier, the conversation between skeptics and optimists thrives. The evolution of humidity batteries from serendipity to global research highlight the unpredictable nature of scientific advancement. Encouraging the wider community to participate, question, and add to the narrative of humidity batteries enriches our collective exploration. With every discovery and challenge, we edge nearer to fully grasping how to tap into the air's power. Thank you for exploring the potential of humidity batteries with us. Your curiosity drives us further into uncharted territories, expanding our knowledge and imagination. As we pursue future innovations, Make sure you subscribe to Mind Polish for more insights into technology and science. Let us know if you're interested in a global comparison of efforts to harness humidity energy. See you in our next topic.